Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music and yes, the new Mary Poppins is coming out so yes, I decided to teach you guys a very awesome song that I remember from Mary Poppins. It's called Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Okay, so, okay, so the best thing in this song is the main theme. I'm going to teach you how to play the main theme of this lesson. Let's get right into it. Before I do it, I'll give you a quick preview so you know what you're going to learn. So it goes like this. To it okay so it seems it looks pretty hard but it's actually not that hard once you get the pattern and yeah even though it's fast it's actually not that bad alright so here we go alright let's get right into it let's break up each um let me see let's break it up into four parts okay so four parts to learn this lesson the first part goes like this okay right hand starts on the D here so middle C go up an octave C D that's where we start okay so it goes D and then three F's one two three and then G F F, D, F, F, G, F, F, E flat. Just like that. That's the first part. One more time. So it goes D, F, 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 G, F, F, D, F, F, G, F, F, E flat. Like that. Okay, pretty awesome stuff. So once you get that, uh, practice slowly and build up the speed. Like that. Okay, so that's the right hand for the first part. So once you get that left hand, we have five chords here, okay? So, yeah, uh, for now, we're gonna do block chords, and at the end, I'll tell you what the pattern is to do, okay? So here we go. So the five chords are B flat major for three times, which is B flat, D, F, so three of them, so two, three. And then the fourth chord is um, B diminished, which is B, D, F. And then the fifth chord is F, seven, uh, the, with C bass, which is also F7, the second inversion of that, okay, which is C, E flat, F, A, okay, so, it's a four note chord here, so, with the five chords here just then, is B flat major for three times, fourth chord, B diminished, and then the fifth chord is F7, C bass, the two hands together goes like this, so it goes, together, 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 like that. You can see that B diminished is actually a passing chord because it's only like, yeah, for that place where it's only like two notes on the right hand per chord there. At the start, it's four notes on the right hand per chord. So, like this. Like that. So, that's what we have for the block chords and melody for the first part. At the end, I'll tell you the pattern I already said. So, let's go ahead now, go on, and move on to the um, second part now, okay? So, the second part, right hand continues. It goes four Fs, one, two, three, four, and then G, F, F, down to C, up to F, F, G, F, F, D, like that. That's the right hand for the second part. So one more time, so it goes like this. It goes F, 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 G, F, F, C, F, F, G, F, F, D, like that, okay? So that's the right hand for the second part, okay? So once you get that, it's the same rhythm as the first part. All of the parts are actually the same rhythm and stuff, so pretty awesome, okay? So that's the right hand for the second part. Left hand, we have only four chords here. The four chords are pretty simple. Uh, we continue on that um, F7 with C bass for three times. So C, E flat, F, A for three, so two, three. And then the fourth chord is just B flat major, which is B flat, D, F, simple like that. Okay, so with those four chords in mind, so three, F7 with C bass for three times. B flat major by itself. The two hands together goes like this: goes F and F7 together. So it's together. G and F7 together. 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 Yeah. Okay. A lot more regular chords here this time with no passing chords. So yeah. So together. 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 pretty much it for the second part so yeah that's that back to back the first two parts that I've learned will be played like this check it out just like that okay so that's that all right now moving on to the third part now okay the third part right hand continues it goes 
Four Fs, one, two, three, four, and then G, F, 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 up to B flat twice, and then C, B flat, B flat, G. That's the right hand for this third part, okay? So one more time, so it goes F, 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 G, F, 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 B flat, B flat, C, B flat, B flat, G. That's the third part for the right hand. Left hand, pretty simple here. Four chords, once again, the four chords. Uh, this time it's a bit different, it goes three B flat major chords, which is B flat D F, so three of them. And then the fourth chord this time to E flat major, which is E flat G B flat. Yeah, so with these four chords in mind, so three B flat major chords followed by an E flat major chord. The two hands together goes like this, goes F and B flat major together, so it's together. G and B flat major together. B flat and B flat major together. Second B flat and E flat major together. Just like that. One more time. It goes like this. Together. 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 Just like that. Okay. So moving on to the four. Uh, but actually, before doing that, let's play the three parts back to back that we've just learned. Goes like this. Some stuff. Moving on to the fourth and last part, right hand continuous goes G, B flat, A, G, B flat, F, F, D, F, F sharp, G, A, B flat, B flat, like that. Alright, one more time, so it goes like this. It goes G, B flat, A, G, B flat, F, F, D, F, F sharp, G, A, B flat, B flat, like that, just like that. It's pretty awesome. Super califragilistic, espialidocious, like that. That's awesome stuff. Left hand, we have five chords here. The five chords are, okay, so it goes first chord, it's E flat major, which is E flat, G, B flat. Uh, the second chord is actually passing chord to E diminished, which is E, G, B flat. And the third chord is second inversion of B flat major, which is F, B flat, D. Fourth chord is F7, which is F, A, C, E flat, and the fifth chord is B flat major, which is B flat, D, F, okay? So with these five chords in mind, so E flat major, E diminished, uh, second inversion of B flat major, F7, B flat major. The two hands together goes like this, goes G and E flat major together, so it's together, A and E diminished together, B flat and second inversion together, F and F7 together, B flat and B flat major together. Just like that, okay? One more time, so it goes like this. Together, 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 together. And that's it. Okay, back to back to four parts where we play like this. Check it out. Yeah. All right, here we go. So. Once you actually get this um, melody and chord version really good, articulate, clear, and like smooth along the way, and it's pretty consistent every single time you play, then you can think about uh, applying that left hand pattern at the start of the preview. Okay, so what the pre uh, what the pattern is is actually not that difficult. What you do for all the chords, right? You want to play the lower note first, followed by the high two notes, and repeat that pattern like that. It's like um ba um ba um ba, but very happy kind of feeling. Okay, and then yeah, same for other ones. And even for like the four note chords, you just start with the lowest note followed by the higher three notes instead. Like that. Okay, yeah, and then just apply it like this. Okay, so yeah, pretty fun song to play around, jumpy, very jumpy. And as for now, if you like this type of teaching method, I have so many of these tutorials on this channel, like this step-by-step -step stuff. So check it out, there's like 2,600 videos on my channel uh, for you to check out and learn on. Okay, but anyway, yeah, also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com to learn more about my piano methods and teachings, okay? Linked in the description below somewhere. Okay, but anyway, as for now, yeah, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.
I'm glad you made it to the end of my video. Now you can visit my website to learn how to play this or any song you want through my methods explained through books and courses. Or just get me to make a full song video lesson or sheet music transcription on any song you want using my customized services. As for now, enjoy your time on my channel, subscribe and see you next time.